Hello everyone, myself at Shama Mead and welcome to my YouTube channel Computernetic Zone for another exciting lecture. In today's video, I will be discussing about various input devices. So let's start and discuss our topic in detail. Input device is any hardware component that allow the users to enter data and instructions in a computer. So we can say that input devices are those devices through which user can enter data and instructions into a computer. We have few examples like keyboard, mouse, microphone, light pen, scanner and barcode reader. These are all examples of input devices. So let's discuss few of them in detail. Keyboard. Keyboard includes keys that allow a user to enter data into computer. There are 104 keys on the keyboard which are further divided into types like alphanumeric keys A, B, C, H, K, L, M, N, O, so on. These are all alphanumeric keys like 1, 2, 3, 4, up, so on till 9. These are all alphanumeric keys. There are three lock keys as well like caps lock num lock and scroll lock we have four direction keys as well left right down and up so these four keys you can see here are direction keys so we have function keys as well uh, like f1 f2 f3 f4 f5 f6 f7 tail f12 these are all function keys next we have is in mouse mouse is basically a pointing device so there are three types of mouse that we have is mechanical mouse that has rubber ball to detect mouse movement you can see here in a highlighted part this is a rubber ball which is used to detect mouse movement next we have is optical mouse that uses devices that emits and sense light to detect mouse movement. So this is an optical mouse. Next we have is cordless mouse that basically transmits data by using a wireless technology, radio waves or infrared waves. This is also called wireless mouse. So you can see the picture here. This is a cordless mouse or wireless mouse next we have is joystick joystick is a pointing device with a vertical lever mounted on the base the lever shows button called triggers so this is a trigger that activates certain events when pressed so when you press this button then certain event will be activated it is widely used by the computer gamers for computer games next we have is scanner scanner is a light sensing input device that converts printed text and graphics into digital form so the quality of the sensor depends on the color depth and its resolution The more depth, the more quality of, is of color depth and its resolution, then you know the more good scanner that would be. So it is used for image processing, that is basically the capturing, storing, analyzing, displaying, printing, and manipulating images. Nowadays, mostly scanners have OCR software OCR stands for optical character recognition 
that converts an image of a text into the text file that can can be edited next we have is barcode readers barcode reader uses laser beams to read barcodes printed on the products showing product information or you can say the product specification like product name manufacturing company expiry date and so on so just through barcode you can get every information about the product the barcode reader basically use light pattern to read the barcode and that light pattern by passing to barcode lines and these are widely used in supermarkets stores pharmaceutical stores and many other libraries for such information next we have is a microphone microphone was invented by MLA in 1877 and that is used for voice recording so that's all for today if you like this video share it if you have any question you can ask that question in the comment section I will definitely respond there if you haven't subscribed to my channel you can subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon so that you can get more updates and more videos in future thank you and have a great day